Hello, I am Dr. Suraj Gupta. I am a consultant nephrologist. I practice in Credence Super Specialty Clinic, Kundao, and Harina Super Specialty Hospital, Kundao. Uh, I will be discussing briefly about chronic kidney disease. Chronic kidney disease or CKD, which is described as a gradual loss of kidney function. Kidneys are an important, one, of the mo one of the most important organs of the body, and the primary function of the kidney is to filter and to clear the toxins from our body. Over the, what are the over time conditions like diabetes, hypertension, holistic kidney disease or autoimmune disorders can lead to dysfunction in our kidney and can reduce the ability or weaken the ability of our kidneys to filter or remove the toxins from our body. What are the most important causes of chronic kidney disease or CKD? Most important causes of chronic kidney disease or CKD is diabetes or hypertension. These are the most prevalent causes of CKD. Other causes or other people who are at risk are people who have a family history of chronic kidney disease or people who take a lot of painkillers or over the counter painkillers. Even a, something as a, insignificant like an ibuprofen tablet can cause chronic kidney disease if used very heavily and for a very long time. What are the symptoms of chronic kidney disease? This, Chronic kidney disease or CKD is in the majority of the times is described as a very silent disease. There are no symptoms in the early stages of chronic kidney disease. Once it advances, the symptoms are very non-specific. Most of the times it would present with vague symptoms like nausea, vomiting, reduced appetite. Gradually as it worsens, it can present, cause swelling in your feet, swelling over your face, Reduced or reduced frequency or alteration in your urine output. Other symptoms can be severe and can be fatigability because of anemia or of uncontrolled blood pressure. These all can present as chronic as the symptoms of chronic kidney disease. And in advanced cases of chronic kidney disease, they can very well present as shortness of breath, inability to lie down difficulty in sleeping, severe itching in your body, all these are common symptoms of chronic kidney disease. How to detect chronic kidney disease? Majority of the times it presents as a, in lot of times it can be diagnosed, it presents by a routine finding in form of lab investigations. The most common investigation is the serum creatinine which is done on the, which is a routine blood test and it can be detected, incidentally detected by an elevated serum creatinine. The other most important investigation is a small, very small investigation, with a very small and very less costly investigation, which is urine routine. And any loss of protein in your urine can be, can signify a chronic kidney disease or CKD. As we are coming in the era of rising prevalence of disease, chronic diseases like diabetes and hypertension, so we will be seeing more and more of chronic kidney disease as well. So. It is important and it is important to pick up these, this disease at an early stage because once it reaches an advanced stage, it becomes irreversible and it becomes untreatable. And the treatment option that, that remains is either dialysis or transplant and nothing else can be done for that. So it is important to pick them early. That is what my message would be. If you have any of these symptoms or if you want to contact me in person, you can either book an appointment through library.com or get a personal appointment by the contact details available. Thank you.